All right, hey guys. Um, in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get, uh, or how to get as close as you can to stretch res. Uh, try not to hate me. Um, I'm trying to do my best here, since it's almost it's basically impossible to get the normal horizontal stretch back. Um, but I mean the vertical stretch. Uh, but um, this I feel like is the best I've gotten at trying to replicate. It, but you know it, it won't be uh, the best for all you guys but we'll see so to start off first you right click on your your forgot what it's called right right click uh, if you have an AMD it'll say AMD Radeon settings if you have a <coughs> Intel it'll say the Intel settings um, click it and then you'll be greeted with uh, if you have an AMD, it'll say display. If you have an Intel, it'll you should be able to find a section that says um, some like you could change your display or whatever. Uh, if not, you could Google it, YouTube it. I don't know. Um, on AMD, and then after that, you go to custom resolutions, click create, and then choose whatever display you play on. Mine's one, and then you'll be right here horizontal resolution. You keep this at 1920 change vertical resolution to 800 800 has been the best from what I've seen you could change it to whatever you like though uh, like 700 900 uh, you could test it out but 800 has been the best for me I think and then for here as well you change this to 800 and then you would click save right but I already have that and it'll be saved down here after you've done that go to uh, Windows key type click Windows key uh, type in <coughs> um, percent app data percent all right you'll be greeted with this folder click it and then click on app data up here after it says roaming click on app data go to local and then Fortnite game saved uh, config Windows client and then you'll be get agreed with game user settings. Uh, click uh, right click, go to properties. Make sure read only is not on. Make sure it's unchecked, right? Double click oh, when it opens. Scroll down you sh until you find where it says resolution size X, resolution size Y. Change Y to 800, right? As right here as well. The last user confirmed resolution size. The last user confirmed. Uh, yeah, change the Y's to 800 scroll down a little more you'll find desired screen width and then desired screen height change height to 800 as well as down here to 800 and those four you'll have to have click file click save you could close it and then you uh, go to display display settings this is what I do yeah, it's not may not be something everyone does scroll down to resolution click that you'll see your new resolution that you created 1920 but 800 right keep changes you'll see these black bars top and bottom you know not everyone may not like it but I feel though feel as though it's better than playing on default uh, default settings the stupid ass 1920 by 1080 16 uh, 16 by 9 resolution um, this is the closest I've gotten to uh, uh, stretch res after the new version uh, what's it called 8.3 update 8.30 update or whatever so you know try not to hate on me I've seen these other tutorials most of them have been utter trash you know I'm not trying to bash but I'm bashing um yeah, so basically, what this is, uh, it changed your the horizontal, I mean the vertical. No, no, what am I talking about? Horizontal to eight hundred. No, 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 no. What am I talking about, bro? Whatever. It changed it so that now there's black bars. Um, 
if it doesn't have that, you could change it to preserve aspect ratio when you have your ADN AMD settings open. Here, let me show you real quick. Uh, here, right? For whatever display, click preserve aspect ratio. Rather than full panel, preserve aspect ratio so that you would keep the black bars. And then this is what it looks like. Instead of this super zoomed in character that it have from this new update, now it looks like this. Even though here it'll say, yeah, it'll say 1920 by 800, which is what you want. Um, I play on Windows full screen and it works well. Um, here, let me just go into a quick, no, no, uh, just a quick game real quick to show you what it really looks like walking around. In my opinion, it works for me. This is the best uh, that I this this is the best thing I've uh, f managed to find uh, throughout. After looking through all the tutorials, I was I started lo looking through it myself, and then managed to flop across this, which seems to see. Uh, your character is not very zoomed in on your screen, which I absolutely love them doing. Oh, this doing? What am I talking about? Oh. And so, as you can see, it's not like crazy zoomed in or whatever. You know? But. Uh, this, I. In my personal opinion, I feel like works the best. Um, yeah, I've said it like a hundred times already, but you know, I'm still gonna get people hating on me. It's like there's black bars, or oh, it's not real stretched. But you know, if you're gonna complain, find a better way and then complain. But if you can't, stop complaining. Cause I can't. If you can't do anything, why not? Why complain? Um. So. Yeah, so this is what it looks like, basically. You can see, basically, most of the body, when you're looking forward, you could, you just did. I feel like it works a lot better than default, even though they are, even though they do have these black bars top and bottom. So, yeah, that's basically it. If you guys have questions, leave them in the comments, I'll try to help. Um, and also, if you have Intel and you can't manage to find the display settings, uh, try to Google it. You should be able to find it easily. Um, and yeah, thank you for watching. Please, please, please share it, subscribe, and bye.